Hello, this is Richard, this is Games Freezer, and this is Richie's rapid review for Pool Nation on the PlayStation 4. Currently £18.99 on the PlayStation Store. But when I think about my favourite pool video games, then immediately I think of Arcade Pool on the Commodore Amiga and Side Pocket on the Sega Mega Drive. The thing with those games is that they were nice to look at with a great control system. They kept it simple and delivered mechanics that assisted you enough to make playing the game pleasurable. It feels like Pool Nation has looked to emulate this approach with a lovely looking and feeling easy to pick up and play version of Pool on the PlayStation 4. It hooks you from the moment you pick up your virtual queue and smash the pack across the bays. The ball physics are spot on, so as you work your way around the table, you start potting balls aplenty from minute one. The aiming reticule is brilliant in giving you a sense of where your target ball will go and where your cue ball will end up, which means that building a break is lots of fun to do. Each pot of a ball is met with a luscious slow motion camera shot as the ball drops satisfyingly into the pocket and the music complements the gameplay nicely. Although I did feel that maybe there could have been slightly more variation in the music and maybe some music could have changed during the game depending on the break or the tense moment of the match. When I began playing, the one thing that did take a little bit of time to get tuned into was the camera angles and how you control them, as the control system doesn't really allow you to fly around the table at will, so sometimes you end up with a bit of a blind spot when you're trying to take on a more ambitious trick shot. A couple of other small gripes are the lack of atmosphere or achievement felt when you win a tournament, as it feels like you would normally normally get some kind of trophy presentation animation when winning a tournament in other games after you've slogged through rounds and rounds of qualification. I also noticed a small glitch when you pot the final ball of a frame and the camera switches to the cue ball again as though you're about to line up another shot but for a non-existent ball. Other than those two small points, this is a fantastic pool simulator that brings a smile to my face when I'm playing it. I'd like to give this an ice cool rating as I think that it deserves to get played by PlayStation 4 players everywhere who love their pool. This is Richard, this is Games Freezer. Thanks for watching.